Well, today we're headed for Port Canaveral to board the Carnival Freedom. Mm. Before we get started with the video, we're going to ask you to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. It's good for the channel. It helps other people find us as well. And don't forget to turn on that notification bell. Ding, ding. That way you'll know when we have videos coming out. Today's cruise day. Cruise day. We're headed to Port Canaveral to board the Carnival Freedom. Yeah. Hey, hey guess what? We're gonna be at Port Canaveral this morning getting on board the Carnival Freedom. yippee ki -yay. The one that the whale tail got burned off of. Yep, that's the one. So we're going to go see it, check it out, find out what it's all about, see how the boarding is, and let you know. Are you excited as we are? Woo! All right. So there's where we're 15 miles from King George Highway. It says we're going to be there at 10.01 a.m. All right, so we're turning here, Terminal A. Hmm. Here we are, Terminal 5. I want the luggage drop-off first. Yep, we're going to the luggage drop-off. There's the terminal itself, and if you look right over there, you there can see with no tail. the tailless carnival freedom. So after you leave that little gate where that dude tells us where to go, we got to stay in the right-hand lane. See right there, it says drop off luggage. That's right. Bit luggage better view of the luggage. carnival freedom. So you pull up to this section here and drop your bag off. Be sure to have those guys a tip, okay? All right, so we made it. The pack mule has got the wheelchair loaded up. Yep. Look at there, there's Miffy. And there's a carry-on bag. There's my camera bag. And look at that, she's ready to go. And we're going, all we gotta do is walk right across the street over there to the Carnival Freedom. yippee Kaye. yay Let's go. Okay, we're in the terminal now. There's my pack mule back there. <laughs> so, next thing will be is boarding the ship. All you need from here is your boarding pass. Okay, we just showed them our paperwork. Now we're heading upstairs. We're gonna take us up the stairs and sit for a little bit. And uh, we're gonna take the elevator because we got the wheelchair and the one leg. Don't neither like one of those things like escalators. Yeah, we don't, neither one of those like escalators, <laughs> right? <laughs> so we're going to be one of the people that take the elevator. Okay, we are upstairs now. We are upstairs at the Platinum Lounge. And the bucket list people are here. How about that? Hi, bucket list. <laughs> we got beer, beer ice. beer. What do we got? Beer, ice, bucket, bucket Caribbean. Yes, all right. All that goes together. Yeah. All right, well, we're going to have a fun cruise. We want to just tell everybody hi again. Hi. So this is the last stop before we actually get on the ship. We're sitting upstairs with the Platinum, the Elites, and the Suites. How about that? And the Suites is not S-W-E-E-T, it's S-U-I-T-E. There's a big difference. How about that? All right. Hi. Hi. Party at two cruising with Sea Lake Journeys. Yeah. Woohoo! That's right. Yes, let's do it. Let's do it. Woohoo! Yeah, yeah, we're going to find out who's buying. Yeah. He is. He is. <laughs> <laughs> They've been doing it longer than me. <laughs> So stay tuned and watch the fun, y'all. <laughs> okay, so we just passed through the face recognition. My face has been recognized. Yeah, they take your picture down at the entrance, and then when you get up here, they just put your face in front of a screen, and it recognizes you, and off you go. Okay, so we're off the Mustard Station G. So don't forget to do your Mustard Station drill. As soon as you get on board, start walking. We're going to show you the inside of a lifeboat real quick. Oh, look, they hold 150 people. See that? 
unless you're tendering. If you use it as a tender, it takes 80. This is our mustard station G. She is going to check us in, see the boarding pass. This is how they know we've actually been here. A demonstration coming up. Okay, now we're going to wait and see where my wife takes me next. I don't know where she's going to take me. Okay, at least she... okay we're off the elevator here at deck nine, Lido deck. This is where the food begins. Oh, it is nice and air conditioned here today, isn't it? I tell you what, it smells so good in here right now. I don't know what I'm smelling, but uh, hey, looks like the Robin in the wheelchair and a, having a, fight. And a chair having a fight. And I think the chair won. <laughs> the chair did win. <laughs> so we're going to go see the food. Looks like we're the first ones up here. How about that? Oh, does that food look good? There's some bananas and some apples. Here's some watermelon. We gotta go up here this way. Watermelon, some mixed fruit there. Apples, bananas, oranges. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Robin can call it out to us. What is I this? I don't know how to say it. That's Tuscan porchetta. It looks really good. Tuscan porchetta. Oh, look at the jumbo pie. Oh, what is that? Jim? Hold on. The camera gets dark after 60 seconds. There we go. Okay, we got jambalaya. Look at that. Mashed potatoes. Oh my gosh, real crawdads. Look at that. Can y'all see that, everybody? Look at that great food. Broccoli, yams, sliced steak, Nantucket fish, lasagna. I want to show you a good view of this Nantucket fish. Look at that. Oh my goodness. That's a meatball lasagna right there. And over there, we got old fashioned chicken pot pie. Hey, it actually looks really, really good. Sliced pepper steak with onions. Mmm, and those yams. I see some yams for you, Nugget. Cheese, meat. Classic Panzanella Tuscan bread and pecorino. Pecorino. Roast radish, new potato salad. Chipotle orange salad. Oh, this is wonderful. Chicken steamed eggplant. Mmm, mmm. That looks like some good old Tater salad right there. Tater salad. Now here's all your stuff for your salad bar. Your beans, your beets, your cauliflower, your peppers, radishes, carrots, onions, tomatoes. Woo! I got everything up here. Look at all those different kinds of greens to put in your salad. Oh yeah, look at there. Let's see if I can get the glare off of it. There you go. Can y'all see that? Mm -mm, that's what's here today. Special today on the Carnival Freedom. And look at this. It says, talk to us about your allergies, intolerances, and dietary needs. They can help you out. If you've got gluten issues, if you've got dairy issues, whatever you got, talk to them. They can help you out with that. Okay. Help and we're following her along. sushi There you go. Bonsai Sushi. Bonsai Sushi mm -hmm. Express. It's on the other side. Deli, yeah. Yeah, yeah Deli's on the other side. That's right. There's Go over and get your sandwiches food. and stuff. Okay. Italian Station coming up. Um, if you, if you don't need more of the salad bar. Good morning. Look at all the, oh, look at there. They got the olives over here, too. Mm -hmm. Olives. Look at that, potato salad, coleslaw. Oh, look at all this great salad stuff. You can definitely find something you want to eat here. I'm getting hungry already just looking at this. I don't know about y'all. And here we got some penny, primavera, pollo, romana. Tuscan beef right there next to it. Over here we got eggplant parmesan. Frito misto. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's frito misto. It's crispy fried and vegetables and spicy marinara and lemon alioli. Italian oven roasted vegetables. 
Patate, if I know. Robin told me we got something y'all want to see. It's called the Mongolian Walk. Uh, oh, you want to see this? Look at this stuff they got over here. Oh, beef, chicken, mussels. And over here they got all the other stuff you want to put in it. Your carrots, your broccoli, your peppers. Looks like squash, onions, noodles, different kinds of noodles, green beans. There's little tiny corns, regular corn. They got it all. And what they do, you can get it cooked with different sauces that you want. The Szechuan, Thai barbecue, or the black bean. How about that? And this gentleman over here is going to cook it up for you. That big old wok. Look at that. So what have you got? So I'm having a Mongolian wok. I have all vegetables and black bean sauce. And can I go? So let's do what it tastes like. It's the taste test time now. Taste test time. Chopsticks. Not real good with these things, but we're gonna give it a whirl. That's right. It's cruise day. You gotta try new things. Today the new thing is chopsticks. Mm. Mm. It looks good. It's really good. So you have to try the Mongolian wok. Alright, this is my partially eaten guy's burger. This is the ringer. I got it with fries. We don't eat the bun because we're uh Avoiding buns and stuff like that with wheat and all that because of Robert no longer can eat that stuff. I know, right? The gluten. It's yeah, a gluten factor. So I'm going to join it. I'm just going to eat this and some of the fries. No bun. Okay, so what happened here? We only got no straw in our rum punches. Why is that? It's not good for the sea life. But the sea life's not going to be up here drinking my rum punch. <laughs> So, so you we, will no longer get straws on any cruise line because it's not healthy for the environment. There's actually a video on YouTube of a sea turtle that has a straw in his nostril and it's just not healthy for them. A lot of um, birds try to eat them and that kind of thing. And so no straws. You can purchase reusable metal straws if you really want to use a straw. And that's a tip from Sea Lake Drinks. There we go. Who have I got here today? Ooh, Eka, my name is Eka. Ooh, Eka, where are you from? Indonesia. Indonesia. Yeah. yeah. Eko's our new friend because he is bringing us rum punch. One tip special. You sure are my favorite right now. <laughs> Thanks for being here with us. Well, we hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to hit that thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. We would love to have you as part of the Sea Lake Journey crew. Oh, yes, we would. Until next time, we'll see you around the channel. See you around the channel.